It seems like we are live. Let me just just check. How are you guys? I hope you are doing well. Yes, we are live. Welcome to the Black Friday Funky Marketing Edition. Let's let's call it like that. Uh, Today we're gonna review your websites, uh, your LinkedIn pages, your Facebook pages, uh, one Instagram page. Thanks for everybody, everybody who submitted their links. Um, and let's let's go through it. Uh, I don't know where you're watching. We are going live in on my personal Facebook page. We are going live uh, in Funky Marketing Facebook group. We are live on YouTube. Uh, and I won't be able to answer your question, probably, because uh, I don't know if I can do it through the restream, but I'll make sure to answer each one of them um, after uh, we finish, so I can check out each platform and, and respond to all of your questions, if there are any. So um, I'm going to share, share my screen here. Uh, share my screen here and let's go. You're supposed to to see this. Uh, I think I think you are. So uh, let's go. First one is uh, my good friend, one of my favorite humans from LinkedIn, um, Yag. Uh, Jak sent his website and also his uh, LinkedIn uh, profile. I'm going to go through both of them, but I'm first going to go through all the websites, then continue with the LinkedIn pages. So Jak, if you're here and you want to see also the analysis of the LinkedIn page, sorry, you have to wait a little bit. Uh, I like the outline. I like overall the colors of the of the website. I like what you did with your name with yellow and uh, and sort of black and white combination. Um, it's a personal website, so it's a little bit different than if it's a business or landing page or whatever it is. Um, First of all, when I look at the page, I see the the logos over there, and I love them when you when you have them in the headline. What I'm missing in in the head section of the website is actually the CTA. I'm missing the CTA, uh, and I, I can see it in the in the upper right corner, but uh, I cannot actually. I don't, I don't have it in the head section. So this is where I would put it. Also, cool. It's, it's about you. Uh, maybe how you can help people. Maybe that's what I put in the, in the head section or maybe as a subhead over here. Um, maybe how you, how are you helping people? Not just who you are and maybe just my preference because it's it's a, it's a personal website and you are it has a purpose of presenting who you are but i think always going uh, about them not about you is is a, is a good is a good thing um, i like when you scroll down that you that you uh, listed on what you can collaborate uh, on with people so speaking marketing workshops consulting uh, startups, all those things. Then you have the section when you when you have your best-selling marketing books. All good things. You can really see how many things you are doing. Uh, your latest writings on your blog post. Also, there's there's a podcast. Also, guys, if you're not following uh, the ABM Conversations podcast, it's one of the best, one of the best in the in the field. So go ahead and and check it out. And here's the CTA at at the end. 
uh, it's cool, but I want to see this CTA also up in the in the head section because like I'm here, okay, and I want to. I know who Yag is. I just came to the website to hire Yag, but I don't see the the CTA over here. Just that one up, which is not something that people actually see when they come to the website. Um, overall, I like it. I like it. I like the appearance of it. Uh, I like that it stands out a little bit with this black and white combination combined with, with yellow. And um, yeah, that's that's it for uh, for my buddy. Yeah, now we have click one. Let's. Let's go check it out. I didn't see the website before. I I enter here, so um, hmm. so I don't know what I'm gonna get. It, this is not something prepared. I'm acting as a customer and coming to your website and just check it out all things. Like click point. I don't remember who uh, who submitted this link, but it's obviously not working. So that's the feedback. Your website is down <laughs> i'm sorry but that's how it is uh let's see another one pixel genium okay okay so besides the color that i don't like it's just my personal preference um uh, it's it looks good uh, i like when i come to the website that i can see it's a leading explainer video company that can help you with turn visitors into customers with video storytelling. It's very clear. Then you have two options to watch video and get package deals. And I don't like in any situation to have two CTAs. When you give people more choices, they don't choose any of them. So let's see what happens when I click watch video. Uh -huh. So I get why choose Pixel Genius for your explaining video creation okay i wouldn't put this uh this thing up here get package deal it's okay you go you go over there right away um i would maybe change this to see how we can help you or find out uh what kind of videos are we creating or find out how we can help you do exactly that so turning visitors into customers with video storytelling uh, I like it. Uh, there are also like logos under it. Um, this amplifies trust. So I can see like Honda, Western Union, some some others that I don't know, but maybe somebody else knows them. It creates trust and it amplifies my, my wish to click on the CTA. So always have that in mind. Less CTAs, if you can have one, just have one. Uh, I don't think there's ever a uh, reason to have more than one. And I don't understand actually this photo over there, this illustration. What does it have to do with the, with the whole head section? I mean, I know that it is illustration because you are creating explaining explainer videos, but these specific ones doesn't give me anything. So three random uh, people and a cat and some plants not resonates with with what you do here. So when we scroll down, you have engage or else compel. OK, a little bit explain where are you based. That's that's good. Um, what you can get to people, what you can give them, three times conversion rates with professionally created custom videos that increase conversion, attention grabbing, compel action. I like these visuals <laughs> comparing to the to those in the head section. Um, and I like that you explain uh, how do you increase conversion, for example. Our videos make it easy for your audience to understand what problems you can solve for them, benefits you offer, and how you are different from your competitors. I, I like that. Uh, Top-notch explainer video services, experience the best in class video production. OK. Um, I mean, I usually don't like this top-notch and uh, those kind of expressions, but OK. It's just my preference. Uh, then you have specific things you do, 2D animation, 3D animation, 
leading to specific landing pages, I guess. Let's try one. Yeah, measure your customers using, uh-huh, you see? I don't see the end of the sentence. If I put my mouth, mouse on the, on the illustration. So maybe you need to fix that. Besides that, okay, those are all landing pages. I like that. It uh, tells me that you know what you're doing, that you know how the SEO works, how to sell your services, how to go into specific audiences and uh, separate your offers. So you have corporate videos, you have motion graphics, whiteboard, I like it. I want to check it out, but let me just check it out, why not? Yeah, you have you have specific landing page for each of those uh, products, and this is great. Uh, I like it. Not many companies actually have have it sorted that way, so this is what I like very much. Uh, you can see the full portfolio. Let's see the full portfolio. Mm -hmm. So those are all the things that you have done. Videos, nice. Nice, and I like that you sorted it by categories. That's that's good. Brands who trust us. Okay, that's always a, that's a good thing. I like this sentence. Don't just take our word for it. Take a look at what our clients have to say about us. Uh, and I like how you did those uh, those screenshots of, of the video because when I click it, I get to see the YouTube testimonial. Which, uh, which is good. Why choose Pixel Genius as your animated explainer video production company? Cool, few more reasons. Uh, competitive pricing unlimited, pays you go money back. I like this because it, uh, it actually explained to the customers, it goes against their uh, biggest objectives. So usually it's, uh, high price, so we have competitive pricing. It goes uh, only like up to three revisions. We have unlimited revisions. It, it says uh, some of them want you to pay them beforehand, but pay as you go, money back refund if you're not satisfied. Those are all great. And I can see that the two are guys are trying to, um, to do the right thing, actually, to lead the customer to the to the buying uh, moment. Get package deal, our explainer video creation process, see how the process goes. Uh, let me check it out. Mm -hmm. You have specific landing page for this, also step-by-step, -step, one, two, three, script writing. I like it, it's transparent, it shows the way you are doing you were doing the work. There's a testimonial also over there. That's cool. And there's a, there's a, there's a blog. Hmm. This thing is a little bit weird. And I can, the way I can see the articles, I cannot click on specific article. I can just go and read more articles. To, I would change this to be actually the three articles that I can click on and go to specific article to read them. Um, now we have, uh, I would put also these logos in the head section also because the five star customers rating from Google, Google verified business, those kind of things mean means more than some other logos that you have uh, in the head section. So I would maybe switch the places. I like that you have a uh, fax section. Got an idea, let's talk. Cool. Cool, uh, I like this one. I wouldn't change it much, only some simple changes and it's, uh, it's 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 great. Uh, okay, let me just check uh, 
chuk, chuk, chuk. what did you what did you write i like this website it looks interesting i would also add here a couple of written testimonials uh yeah i agree that was the first one yaks uh video should be with subtitles well yeah i didn't i didn't play them so i uh, didn't pay attention to that cool objection uh too many verse here in opening section of this website uh if it's for yak yeah if it's uh pixel genius no uh okay let's go i like that you are helping each other in the in the comments that's that's great just just keeping keep doing that together we uh we are even better so let's let's move on we have here by gremlin <laughs> let's see this is an old school website i would change the design right away uh, and it's basically basically a blog template and it's kind of hard to give feedback on something that is created on a blog template or something like that i don't know um i come to this let's call it a, like a website and uh i see by gremlin mostly harmless What's bike gremlin? What is mostly harmless? Gremlin is harmless. Okay, I guess that's it. But what it is and why it is harmless? And I see, okay, newsletter subscribe, but what am I subscribing to? So let's say I look at the menu. Okay, I'm seeing like reviews, basics, bearing brakes, wheels. Okay, so I get kind of a, a sense of what it is i get here a chance to go to the youtube bikes and cycling from an enthusiast for the enthusiast this should be one of the first things that i'm seeing over there who are we what is our mission okay let's see by gremlin website provides Info about cycling, really things, things, bicycle repairs, and maintenance, instruction, cycling, clothing, the, 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 so many things. There are posts that explain basic things for beginners. There are also posts that explain advanced riding. Okay, this should be somewhere up here. I don't know. It's just a strange, strange logo, strange construction. I think you just need a uh, new template i can see that there is a content but the content is not visible in a way that it helps me see what you are doing and what this is all about and the way you can help me like as a as a, as a bike lover um i can see that there's a good content over there but mm, i can't get to the content basically there's i don't know where to go i don't know what is this about the actor why you're also posting where are we posting what are the roles of posting how to post the question okay so there's a sort of forum or something like that okay okay i definitely don't understand it and i don't think anybody else would understand it i'm a bike lover and i'm coming to the website that is supposed to be about bikes but it's too complicated i get this, this table of content there is i don't know I just don't know what to say about it that's it let's let's just uh let's just move on let me see what what you said definitely need design change yeah i think that that will help this one seems to be like a blog and it's that classic old school blog blog design 
So let's go from that perspective. It's on in it's in Serbia. So sorry if you if you can't understand. It's kind of just you just go here and it's a place where somebody is posting stories or those are poems. Let me just check it out. Yeah, like essays, stories. It's good. I mean, it's it's a solid place just to have uh, some stories, creativities, those kind of things. You have write me a story place uh, in which we all tackle the the ideas. So it has a part of ideas and creativity. I guess those are uh, categories. It has uh, stories uh, of her own. I guess it's a female. I don't remember who actually sent the, the, the link, sorry. They have like stories from other people, which is also nice, stimulating others to, to write. We have the part which says about me. Ah, yeah. Okay, so it's Anna who sent who sent the the link. Uh, hi, Anna. That's cool uh, thing about about her, and I like it. I mean, I like stories. I write. I like writing stories. I like writing, writing also poems, all those kind of things. It's cool for the personal blog. It's it's nice and I think I'm gonna say the word cozy. It's especially now it's winter. It kind of gets me cozy to read stories and um, yeah, that's yeah. I also think the simpler the simpler. Uh, the better. I agree. I agree with you guys. Um, let's check another website. Let me just drink a sip of the coffee. Mm. Vienna or virtually? Whew, we are announcing Offline conferences, I like it. The autonomous, shaping the future of safe autonomous mobility. Join the autonomous hybrid event on March 21. Okay, so this is um, the website for the specific event. And when I know that, it's, um, it's kind of cool to see the kind of environment of the event uh, in the head section of the website. Choose it too. You have get tickets. You have watch video. Watch the video. Okay, so it is. Her. Yeah. Again, I mean, you have this video in the background. Why would you want me to watch another video, which is probably like similar? Uh, so you don't make me do that. Uh, just help me to get the tickets because if I'm here and I want to join, I will get tickets. Otherwise, I will just scroll down to get educated on more things. Why should I join? So join the ecosystem working towards global reference solutions. You are invited to join forces in harmonizing safety in the autonomous mobility ecosystem. Um, let's click the initiative to see what's, what will happen. So, okay. Shaping the future. Aha, uh -huh. so you are basically describing the the initiative. The, I don't think you didn't you need a special page for that, but cool. Cool. If you already done it, it's okay. Um let's let's move on. I have some other things to say, but I want to look the whole thing again. Meet the speakers, experience top executives, the decision makers of the autonomous mobility industry share. It's kind of uh, this is what I wanted to say. It's kind of hard for me to focus on reading when I have so many things moving everywhere. Left, right, uh, head section, everything is moving. And it's hard to be focused on reading anything 
when the picture is getting my attention. So let's see the speakers. Yeah, this is the overlay color. I like it. It's pretty simple and it's pretty obvious to show what, what, uh, what it needs to show, the agenda. Okay, that's, that's cool. Let's move on. Connect with the international community, more than 500. Okay, so this is where we can see the, the agenda. Then we go to big names, bigger ideas, speakers. Uh -huh, the section of the speakers, then the agenda. I was just rushing through the numbers over there. Then we have more photos, news. Okay, view all downloads. Hmm. I like that you have the recap of the events. I don't see that many event organizers are doing this, especially in the way that you can download them. That's kind of kind of an interesting approach. So these are probably the partners and the sponsors. Yeah, partners. CTA become a partner. Yeah. I look like I would just change change some of the videos to the photos, not this one in the background. I like this one, but there is there are too many moving parts and I cannot focus on reading. So this is the thing I would I would change also maybe maybe these white letters are sometimes not uh, not very visible when it comes to the video behind so maybe this you can do something about about that too and you don't need this cta watch video when you already have video inside and you have even three more videos i think when you scroll down so this would be this would be my feedback for the autonomous it looks like a like a great event and i don't know it's maybe time for me to visit to visit vienna See what the guys say. The video in the background is too fast, too much distractions. Yeah, that's all of them are too fast. And yeah, they, you agree with me? Cool. Uh, 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 let's see. Yeah, this is the, the same one. Okay. Let's see. This one. Oli. Well, B world, Olivetti world. Ah, okay, okay, sorry. Um, okay, it seems like other personal personal blog. Okay, slider drivers, gastronomy, talents, coach events, Olivetti life, ticket to life. It's interesting that. Olivera named it Olivetti World. I always like when people when people do that. It's kind of hey, you welcome to my world. Now you are here on this website. You are in my world, and I'm gonna show you what what my world is all about. So Olivetti World is a blog of excellence in life and business. Deals with issues of life. See how it's different than the previous blog. Here it is written why what actually is Olivetti World. It's a blog of excellence in life and business. It deals with specific issues and it gives you uh, advice. Here you will be familiar with all the areas in which you can we can help each other to reach our goals. There's also the aim. The aim of this blog is to work on ourselves, our life and business challenge, to focus on our aims in all segments of life and to reach a state of well-being. Um, I like the introduction. There are also categories. So, Olivetti Life, Ticket to Love, Networking, Astronomy, Drivers, Talents, Coach Events. I mean, I like it because I know where to go. If I'm into gastronomy, I will just click here and go and read about gastronomy. If I'm into networking, I'm going to focus on networking. And um, yeah, that's. That's cool. That's who is. 
Oliveira from Subotica. Nice to meet you, Oliveira. Cool, cool, cool. Then we have the blog with all those things. We have announcement. The part from the little girl in her mother's he high heels to dad's shoe designer. Interesting. Interesting. Cool. Uh, I mean, I like it. Uh, I don't like the design, but I like the I like the content. I dislike this this color. I think it it kind of not goes with the with the name. But if we just slightly change the design or the colors, I think it would be it would look much better. Okay, let's let's go, let's go and see quality wolves. Quality wolves. Oh, when you open the website and a wolf is looking at you. <laughs> okay. Kind of confused. Let's see. So quality wolves tell us your idea will turn it into the product. EOS Android web hardware. Okay. I think it's not specific enough. I keep telling that to people who are doing development, you need to be more specific. Uh, so let like we use software to create a better uh, to create products that solve this and this problem. It, can, it sounds better, right? And quality wolves, I still don't don't understand. The name, maybe there's a explanation. Let's scroll down to see what we, yeah. Also, the letters are white and the background is this whitish um, color. And if I just go back, I won't see the letters. So this is something to think about. CTAs are different if I click on the contact us, I go to let's chat. Okay. And if I click on start your project, I go to the same thing. So why are these CTAs different? Because if I want to start my project, I maybe expect something else. And if I want to contact you, maybe I'm expecting something else. Think about what kind of expectations are you creating with your copy? with your uh, calls to actions. Then we go core services, mobile development, web development, internet of things, research development. Okay. These are like maybe your finished projects. Okay, but you never said what are those. Okay, what are clients say? Okay, cool. There's a chance to leave your review. I don't think it has a place over here. This is definitely not a place for leave your review CTA. And it, I'm not sure if it's a CTA or whatever it is. It's just a random thing over there. I like this, how you explained it. Uh, you can go to Clutch, you can go to Good Firms, you can go to LinkedIn and give reviews. Uh, but I don't think it has a place over here. It has a place somewhere else. Quality blog. Okay, quality wolves, quality blog. Okay, I get the analogy. Uh, what's next? Introduction call projects, project road me. I always like when companies present like the how the process is going. Let's check. Okay, so look, there's a thing here. I still have no idea who you are. 
why did you choose the name Quality Wolves? I know that you are doing that you are doing this core services, but I don't know if you have done this, or maybe you've taken somewhere from the internet, because you didn't tell me. You just guessed that I would guess that this is what you do. Uh, then you asked me to leave a review when I'm at your homepage, and I just came to your homepage, and you're asking me to give you your review. Then, OK, there are some quality blogs. What's next? Da, 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 da. OK, is there somewhere part about you that I'm missing? Let's see. No, that's it. But it's for developers. Uh -huh. So there's a thing where you are, are benefits for developers. Okay, okay, focus on hiring you. Can you tell me? Sort of interesting trying to provoke conversation, but look, I think there's a lot of fluff here, uh, a lot of things that. Uh, that you forget to mention or you assume people know uh, there's this wolf in the background that I have no idea what it represents. There are letters that are whitish as the background is. There is EOS Android web hardware. Okay, so I need to guess that you are maybe using those, but those are just guesses. You left too many empty spaces for, for somebody to guess. And yeah, I think that's that's enough. I think that's a good feedback. Um, some of the, I like the design overall if we don't look at this part. So it's simple, but you don't, uh, the difference between simple and not giving given enough information is huge. So this is something you need to think about. Uh, <laughs> let's see what, Personal preference, I would change font and text size. Definitely, the paragraphs seem to have much more text than expected, and they are bigger than expected. I don't have much time to take client extension, much text doesn't do that. Yeah, the name is too much out of the context. Yeah, too confusing. Definitely. I mean, the things that, that we are looking at here are some obvious things, and it's something that everyone would tell you. So let's go take a look at another one. It's it's in Serbian again. Sorry, sorry for that. Uh, provision everything for your security. That's that's what it means. From my side, it looks professional. Uh, when you are into security, usually those are the, that kind of website. So they have like. Um, video safety, alarm systems, interphones, all those kind of access control. Mm -hmm. So maybe just, his, I don't know why people like to put so much white on, on everything, even on the background, just having a slightly uh, darker overlay in the background would make the text and everything seems more visible. And I would put this to be a CTA like all red, not only when I when I hover over it, just so it can get my attention. I mean that's the that's the point, right? About the shop, about the news. Um, Maybe uh, I would here put something about you. That is the first thing. So who are you and what do you exist for? Then I would go into other things about the shop, news, uh, manufacturers, the most wanted products. I get that. Automation. Uh, wireless alarm system. Then we have so okay <laughs> this is the most wanted articles and these are like the newest articles okay the newest things for the blog 
brands with which you're cooperating with. There are some specific things, okay? So things that they say that they have all the pricing with uh, additional the taxes, the way uh, you can buy availability of the products, um, distribution. I mean, it's an e-commerce website for security, sort of. And um, I just want this darker overlay so I can I can actually see some things. CTA overall in, in red, uh, maybe something about the company. Do we have this somewhere? Let me check. Mm, no, we don't ever have like, what's their mission? What's the the goal, what's the vision? Why do we exist? Maybe there's in a uh, in foot there. It's about, it's about the shop or about the company? Let me, let me see. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, I don't know if it's meant to pop up right now or because I try. Mm, hmm, who knows? But okay, it, it I didn't get the pop up right right away, and I liked it. It went on after after a while. I don't know if it's only on this page. That's why I'm, I was thinking, because if somebody comes to check about your page, maybe it's not the right place to put a pop-up. Maybe it's meant for other pages, but I don't know. This is something that I'm not sure if it's because I changed the page and come here or it's timely based. I think here now the letters are too big, both the headline and the subhead. Um, this is probably for specific offers and you probably guess that people come to this page already know what you are all about. <clears throat> okay, this is sort of about us page. Why should you choose us? Products. I think you need to share some of that on the home page. Definitely. You have just just a link to it. It's it's this one over here. But I, I would like to have it here. Okay, so this is my feedback. Let me see what 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 you guys are selling saying. Uh yeah, it looks professional. Yeah, that's it. You guys probably don't understand Serbian, so uh, pivot approach, let's see. I know that website, uh, now I was looking at it. So when you come to the website and it says pivot approach, I don't know what do they do. And I need to scroll down to see, am I that much that interested in this or I ain't? I probably ain't, so I will just go out of it. It looks nice, nice design, clear letters, but it doesn't say anything. So let's assume I want to know more. So I go down and okay, I see kind of photo of a team, let's say, and then I need to scroll one more time. So I need to scroll three times to come up with what we do. We all know, and then again, it's not clear but I need to read, to read, to come up with what we do. So do, 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 need to scroll like four times. So we come and message And still I need to read all of it just to understand. There isn't like in one sentence, we do this, we do that. We help you with this problem. We help you with this problem. So it's time, okay, it's, written in a sort of, there's a good idea behind it, but I think the implementation, 
wasn't that that good. There's our story, okay, so then come like a couple. Um, there's a material to create a great story and a great website, but this is not it. I even like the design. It just need uh, to go with certain structure so we can get to all those things. Okay, so that's that's my feedback on it. Mm, it has content, it has a story, it has um, it has a design, it doesn't have a good structure. And because of that, it suffers. It's kind of a quote, a good quote. Okay, let's move to the uh, last couple of websites. This one is co-working assembly. Let's see when I come come to it. It says expand your network and resources by adding your voice to the European co-working assembly. Join our email community. You could have given me more than 10 seconds for this pop up. Maybe until I scroll like half of the page or at least three minutes or five minutes, or you can edit when I go to exit the website as an exit pop-up this way i would just click the not interesting so you usually come to this website co-working assembly when you are into co-working and you know what you're after so you don't come to it just uh, because you want to. so i'm gonna guess this is the question and when i come to the website i send expand your network and resources by adding your voice to the european co-working assembly and okay i'm not sure it's completely clear to be honest um as somebody who is from the co-working background expand your network and expand your resources by adding your voice how am i going to expand it by adding my voice this is something that bothers me a little bit so you said under it connect amplify support Okay, the European Coworking Assembly offers its members the ability to access platform resources. Okay, now there's an explanation, but I think this part needs to be bigger. This part needs to be more visible. Uh, so we have two CTAs. One is to become a member and second is to speak to a representative. In this case, I like to two CTAs. I didn't expect to to come up to a website when I like to uh, to CTAs, but I like you can become a member right away, or you can speak to a representative if you're not clear about what does it all mean. Struggling to grow your network within the co-working environment, you're open to Zoom. Like this is for me even better than starting struggling to grow your network within the co-working environment. It's and then subhead expand your network and resources by adding your voice to the European co-working assembly. That's how I would do it. What we can offer you as a member, cool, maybe a little more explanation about it. You just posted the icons, come on. You could have give it a little bit more effort. How to become a member of European Working assembly, okay, there's a process. Cool, become a member, it's clickable, but it's not visible. So make this bigger, make it a CTA, make it a button. What makes the European co-working assembly different from other co-working organizations? Okay, you don't need to put everywhere to CTA. It's now we are going extreme. It's enough in one place. Pricing plan, membership fees, way to support. Okay, okay, okay. Join other assembly members, speak to our newsletter. Yeah. Mm, look, there are a few things that is driving me off of this website. First, 
mm, unclearness of everything. It seems to be unfinished. Uh, and the second thing is the colors. Sort of like blue color is the color that I connect with enterprises. With like, I don't know, those kind of things. Co-working is something that is more um, informal. And I want to see it in more informal way. It seems so formal for the for the co-working. Uh, that's my that's my feedback. Let's see what what people watching said. I don't like designing, and it looks like a material did copy and design. Yes, yes, it looks like it. It's for for the huge organization. I mean, as an organization assembly. It should look more professional and it should look much better. Uh, more informal, another more clear, more information and uh, a lot of other things, less CBAs. Let's go forward. Yag, now we are starting with it. Um, LinkedIn profiles, analysis, tip for color, light green, or some color of that sort. That's something I'd like also. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, let's let's see. So, Yak, it's time to look at your profile. I like the cover to do that. Ted speech. I like that you have all those logos. I like the profile photo, which is sort of like mine when the light is on the face with the dark background. Top 100 global marketing influencer, TEDx speaker, author of top revenue marketing, host. Okay. Um, I would just change this, as I say, the thing for the website. I would change what can you do to help me? Uh, okay, let's go further. Let's go further. Okay, about section. I'm young, one of the top two. Now, this is uh, kind of the same as your um, headline. And here, I would like to have like three sentences which will make people go and read more. Maybe this will make them read more, but I always like to focus on something that is um, focused on helping them. I have to play the role of setting up the role narrative in the capacity marketing industry and marketing consultant. Uh, maybe this can be acted if we change it a little bit, a sentence that can go first, then what this other thing, you have passion, I give it a lot of happiness, sense of purpose. To just start the weekend together with my good friend Manish Nepal, we host APM, also speaking international, and my pet projects include contributing to publications. I like it. I mean, it's formative, it's what you need there. Featured some TED Talks, YouTube, Forbes, YAG, you need here ABM Conversations podcast also. Uh, okay, okay, let's see uh, some activities after. Now I want to scroll down experience. So it's all done well. Speaking, you have explanation, descriptions, links. Guys, do all those things uh, in a, you know, on your profiles. This is greatly done. He shares everything, he shares all what he had done. Uh, look how back he goes, 2008. So I want to know how he had become the TEDx speaker and influencer and everything. Well, there you go. You can just scroll and see all the things that he's doing and all the things that he has done. Education, license certification, volunteer experience, Skills and endorsement. Okay, I don't consider them much um, valuable because anyone can come and endorse you. Uh, recommendations, yes. 
uh, like recommendation yes he have a lot of them a lot of them he has given and a lot of them he has received uh, publications languages interests so it's filled in profile and I don't have much much to say uh, to Yak except these things that I did I just said let me check the the activities I know that Yak is commentary uh, commenting often and being interactive that's what you need to do when it comes to the post let's see There is a certain type of post that Yag is posting most of the time. They're not very long posts, but uh, there's Yag writing to me. <laughs> um, so it, he has his own style. I would like to, to say to say that those are, uh, yeah, you see how he's listening to the CTA. <laughs> uh, so basically he has his own way they're not long posts they're not like two sentences short posts there's some thing in the middle and he of, often takes a tackle some uh interesting controversial points that he points out and he knows to whom he's talking about and he doesn't want to go broader than that and it's enough for him i think so so yeah that's that's it for for yak uh you can check yak's profile and learn a little bit from him he's doing a lot of things uh on a good way uh this is why people should invest in quality copywriters and designer yes yes definitely all the time let's see with with dan my man from novi said we should drink beers or coffee sometimes so um first of all i don't see the the cover photo sometimes it's about me or about someone else looking at this uh but like mm, i don't uh i see sometimes people have cover photo and linkedin is not showing it so sorry brother if you have it but i don't see it so maybe you can edit or maybe this is the cover i don't know if it's like that i think you need a new one um photo i usually don't like to comment profile photos but you can add just a little bit of smile maybe just uh, a smile that is just starting you know what i want to say uh, I think it would be good social media specialist at executive digital. That's cool. Uh, about section, there isn't any. Just Instagram, DM yeah, Mishko. You can add something, describe your experience, describe what are the tools that you uh, are working with, what is your experience, what are some things you're doing outside of the business. I know you're an interesting guy. Just maybe you can share that on LinkedIn with the world. Um, also, maybe you want to go to the, that, that also goes for everybody. Uh, go to the who view your profile, um, to the settings, and there's a, there's a specific things. This is all, this is what I'm talking about. People also viewed. You maybe don't want that turned on because those are the people when somebody is searching for uh, people of your profile, they will find also these people. So they are basically your competition in the in the search. At least that's how I'm seeing it. So maybe you want that turned off because they come to your profile. Okay, they're gonna see who else can I view. They go to Predrag, they go to Yanya, they go to Maya or Zoran or someone else. So uh, okay, let's let's see. We'll check the activity. Uh, later let's go social media specialist okay graphic designer photographer education that's that's all cool uh, have some endorsements accomplishments when it comes to languages interest i think you are more interesting than what you are showing us so this is this is my my biggest takeaway so show us how interested you really are uh, let's see the 
posts not very active well let's say from time to time you didn't you weren't active for three weeks but you seems to be active active before uh different kind of posts they're like uh checklist instructions for creating a brand on instagram what you should do there's, there's photos with some processes there's also a overview from the company's window um yeah different kind of um content different kind of post text seems like yeah you are going all the way trying all different things sharing things that that work i mean maybe you just need to see what what's working and choose your own your own voice uh you're a designer so you actually were a designer yeah a photograph so i can see that you are more into photos and visual side of things but maybe you can give some insights maybe you can go deeper into specific topics uh i think you're a person that can share all kind of things that we are probably not seeing and you as the ex or current photographer are maybe seeing some things that we aren't also when it comes to like social media and overall it would be a good good overview to to hear that uh to, to, to say never you should make a video series when you invite different people to review websites with you that sounds interesting and i had that idea so maybe we'll we'll do that uh, i think in 2018 there was somebody who was doing that um, i think i saw that they did a review of obsessed websites at the time so this is my buddy gala from from twitter search engine optimization that's cool um, i mean he's uh doing seo so he's showing us that profile picture is okay gala you can you can smile a little bit as well digital marketing professional seo specialist content marketing manager tech enthusiast diehard new york knicks fan cool nice um maybe you can say what can you do to help me as well besides all this um experience seo specialist certified by google and same rush for seo fundamentals keyword uh is responsible to that's cool but maybe before that you can tell us like i can help you rank your website better or be seen by specific target group you want to target those kind of people also the same thing goes for people also viewed seems like you and dan are in the same category by by, by linkedin uh yeah for dan also i forgot to tell you uh, you don't have featured us section you can create a feature us section when you can add the link to your instagram profile which is your preferred go-to place and some other links of some of the work that you have been that you've been doing um activity we'll check it out later experience executive design executive digital okay okay we make right after the college you went you started working in uh, in an agency okay cool you have all the things that you have done over there i like that you listed all of it i always like that uh, licenses and certifications uh good uh, and it shows that these are new from 2020 i need to to go over them to get mine uh yeah skills and endorsements okay maybe some reviews you can ask people your colleagues to give you a recommendation a review you you did do one for them so they can do one for you this goes the same for for them uh let me go check check the activities I always like to look first at the post. <laughs> okay, CV. Like these kind of things don't get much traction. 
like one yeah that's the level of traction they get so don't share other people's posts you do it by posting it on your own and then tagging people uh, whose content you share and yeah gala seems to don't know that because it goes the same for sharing articles sharing those things linkedin is platform when you don't share when you go organic native on the platform what would you prefer to choose some questions facts um, seems like he wants to be active but he is just not managing it so god try being active try posting at least once in three days it will it will look good for you uh let's go further let's go further pixel junior okay so Molay Day is actually the guy that whose website we we checked before. I help businesses drive conversion and engagement. And then, okay, cool. Now, I don't know if that's this is the good thing or bad thing. You tell me. I don't have an opinion. It's uh, Pixel Genius. It's not his name. Is the name of the the company in the username. So. I don't know if it's a good thing or the best thing that I don't have um, data behind it to say it's a good or a bad thing. So this is maybe something to think about. We create amazing animated explainer videos. That's, that's cool. Clear. Providing services, video production, video animation, animation. Okay about i'm a native and explainer video creator veteran in the fields also this one should go first we create handcrafting custom animated explainer videos for business yeah i'm just looking how it is different from the from the headline section and then you go by all these things his studies don't have an effect of being shared here. That's why you have, I like that you have like the process and everything and the phone, WhatsApp. Um, this is what you put in the feature section. That's why it exists. Also, you put that under your company, uh, under the experience, which you did, but you didn't put it the right way. You need to add it as links so it can be seen over there, like Yak did. Education, okay. <laughs> so you spend a lot of time building this business, brother, and uh, congratulations for that. I hope you are successful. Uh, I can see that you give it a lot of thoughts. You have some recommendations are given, some received, which is always good accomplishment. Yeah, maybe you, uh, I just need a background story here. A background story of uh, how did you come up to be explainer video creator of veteran? Why did you create the company? Um, I need that mission vision over there to find out why you are doing what you are doing this is something that's that's, uh, that's missing for me let's see how the engagement goes or the boss actually social media do, 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 blog link in the first comments okay so i have a question because i'm seeing i've been seeing this post Molly, uh, some of them you tag me often. I didn't respond to any of it. And I'm going to give you the reason why. It's because I don't know why did you tag me. It seems like you are just tagging random people who have engagement to get engagement on your post. Um, at least that's how it sounds to me because I, I weren't related to any of the things that you posted and where you tag me so there's go the there goes the feedback definitely interesting posts these can be like higher resolution uh, 
but these are always I mean this one is not interesting but it can be interesting like I've seen a lot of companies that are creating videos for like 11-12 seconds and they're really getting attention with that because they're persistent with it and they are really showing something this video isn't showing me anything it's just like the basic video and you just edit it because well because you could um, yeah it's always like the blog links in the comments that um, seems like to be honest it seems like you're trying to get too fast to somewhere maybe you can try and go with sharing your story your background that personal touch is missing like here's one yeah that's what i want to see more so happiness for me was receiving gifts on my birthday yeah those kind of things i want to see to see more of those kind of things more of stories behind it why did you create specific videos for specific clients um give me that emotion don't get too much into technical details technical details are, are okay and give me also the pain points go over pain points why people need this why people need this i like that you go on the technical stuff but add more of these kind of things so and don't mind if i said something wrong if i didn't see it all uh, just my overview of like five minutes even less so uh let's go let's go further chad Chad says open to work. I don't know if that's a good thing. I never consider it a, a very good thing just to go there and write it out there. You have some specific knowledge and maybe you can position yourself as professional in something and then you can get, you can show that you actually know what you are doing and you can get the job based on that. That's how, how I'm seeing it. Corporate sales director, data strategies, coach, revenue operations, capacity and yield manager, problem solver. Maybe there are too many things over there. I'm kind of um, annoyed by seeing people put so many things over there, like I'm the professional and I know so many things. That might be true. We all know so many things, but focus on one thing that is your focus. Who are you trying to reach out and how can you help them solve their problem? That's how you create the headline and everything else around it. So let's go about lead people. This is what I want to see more. So the, these three lines, even on the start of the about section in your headline, everywhere. So I can see that you've been doing things, a lot of them, but just show them in a little bit different, different way. Not so it seems like you are bragging around, but it seems like, so I've been here for some time now, I work on specific things, and this is what I can do to help you get to your goal. I like, let's have a conversation. CTA, that's what I like. I like that you have, some of your posts here in the feature section. Um, executive member of the Revenue Collective. Uh, sounds good. I like Revenue Collective. I like Revenue Genius also. And I like what you did here. So this is the experience I'm looking for next opportunity leading a sales team in SaaS. So this is also good. I would never recommend to anybody put this in a headline, but I would maybe recommend it to you because it sounds good and it sounds like you know what you are searching for. The other director says, you see, there's a huge experience behind it. You just need to show it in a little bit different way. Education, skills, leadership, uh, received, given recommendations. Cool, you probably can get more recommendations. I would advise to go reach out to people and get those recommendations based on your experience. 
Um, let me see, let me see the posts. What kind of post are you doing? Um, okay. Lavender helps me my thoughts. Okay, this is about the lavender, about the company. Uh, top sales engagement. Ch -ch -ch um, I don't think photos are working that much. Maybe you can just go and share your experience. I don't know. At least that's that's my that's my idea. More text, less photos. Try to show what you what you know. Because I don't see it. I've seen that you are giving, um, uploading other companies and other people what they are doing. This is great, always great. Don't post too much links. Don't post too many photos, but focus on showing what you know more than praising others. Praising others is good in the comments, in and everything, but focus on what you what you know, how you share your points, go over pain points, share your story, share your background, go talk, talk more about, about those things. Quotes, they don't work. I mean, they're okay, but they won't get you anywhere where you want to go. They will just create people who will really like on this and nothing else. That's my five cents based on, based on this. So let's go, let's go, let's go. Mm -hmm. Autonomous, now we have the company page. We looked at the website, that one with, uh, with too many videos. Just to drink a little bit of juice. Okay, the global community shaping the future of safe autonomous industry. About section is okay. They're using events also on LinkedIn. How are you guys with events on LinkedIn? Are you using them or no? I find them like a waste of time because you need to add all the people manually, but you don't get much out of it. I mean, you get the people to visit your profile. Maybe that's one thing that's good. So I don't know. Just share with share with me if you're using. LinkedIn events and how you're using them and um, why are you using them? What are some benefits that you are getting from them? Choo, 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 choo. Let's go. Let's see. Overview. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We look forward to your participation. Okay, cool. I mean, you did it all here. By the book, location, Vienna. Okay, I want to see the post. I like that you tag people. I don't like that you use that you're using links here. This, I mean, sometimes I would use also links, but not all the time. Not with this kind of like pictures. Autonomous safety and security reports. I like this. This one I like. I like a lot. You are using LinkedIn to share. Uh, reports, those that we saw on the website, I guess. Tune in today. Mm, you know what I'm missing here? I'm missing like, I don't know if you already, yeah, virtual meeting. Okay, I've seen that you're using, organizing a lot of events. And that's good. But what I'm missing is the thing that I'm missing from most of the companies that are organizing events. I miss, I'm missing the distribution of what happened in that event. Nobody's talking about it. So you just went to an event and did, and now we go to second event. But wait, what happened on the previous event? Where are the recordings? Maybe you can cut it out in small pieces, distribute it, create additional content, create additional engagement, get more participants to your next event by doing it. I mean, guys, things are that simple and you should do it. Um, let's go, let's go to the next one. We are slowly reaching the end. Dan Reynolds, I am Dan Reynolds. I like this username. 
chief communities officer at Ali Brand Strategies at CRAKD, chief communication as well, founder of Pure Clean Earth. Sounds good. I would also add like, what do you do? How do you help people? Always. This is a comment for everybody. I build clever marketing strategies that communicates inspired dreams and ideas. Okay. Maybe you can rephrase that to kind of uh, make it more, more clear for, for somebody who might reach out to you, hire you, call you to speak on a podcast, doesn't know whatever it is that you want to do. Uh, so it's not bad, but making more for them. Spend the last three years building head turning companies, driving social media goals and community with a new football brand seven years. And I can do the same for you, like after this one. Uh, uh, that's how I would put it. I found a pure clean earth in 2018, environmental room. That's all good things. Agency joined Volley, Mercury Mission Create Branding Marketing Strategy that was supporting success at launch in early 2010. I like it, it's clear and it's not too much. It's less is more thing, but just put something. How can you actually help those people? Not what you do about me on LinkedIn, on the website, everywhere is about the customers, not about us. So chief communication officer, I like that you um, listed what is your all about. You give their mission. I love those kind of things. And I like that you said that you were a receptionist in public relations at Urbani Hostel. This is what I want to see more. How did you get to be the brand strategist? How did you get to be the founder, the chief of communi communities? Well, I was first a receptionist and doing public relations for the hostel. Before that, I even did some other things. I was a social media manager, I was a personal trainer. I was director and event leader when I learned a thing or two about the community. Then I was food, before that I was food and beverage assistant, then personal trainer again. You know, these, these are kind of the things that I want to see more. You didn't just become a professional, an expert. You had a specific journey that um, guided you there, that made you what you are today. So volunteering experience, a lot of volunteering experience. Love it. Recommendations, cool, cool man. And the feature dust section, show some of your best posts, show some of uh, the links, some of the websites of the things that you are working on. Let's see a little bit of the, um, mm -hmm, first post on LinkedIn. Okay, okay, cool. Focus. I like it. I'm seeing your post in, in my feed and uh, you're mixing it up doing, oh, here you share my post. <laughs> Thank you. The feed cafe, you are what you do, not what you say to do. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay. I'm seeing, I've seen people sharing uh, post from the company pages. I don't see it work. I don't know if somebody saw something else, let me know, but I don't see that work as a tactic. And I don't see posting too many photos actually work again. So maybe something else. More of Instagram, um, more like uh, text and sharing knowledge is going over pain points, sharing personal stories and less Instagramish. That's what I see working. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let me see. Andres Smith. Alexander Smith, sales manager, co-founder at Smith.rs Media, video surveillance, RAM system, intercom. Get automation road barriers. Okay. Mm 
Okay. I will just maybe draw this one. I will put like this one. So it, it is the same. And it can be said a little bit better about okay probably targeting Serbian market so it's in the Serbian and she explained it well the thing that I'm telling to all of you that you should explain what it is for them she she wrote that so it's it's cool and I like it good job with this even has a feature section with great feature photos Actually, those are like posts, I think, but it's good. I can see how all of them are clear and well designed. Security system sales manager, online sales, content writer. Yeah, also she shares the journey of how she gets there. You already get it, what, what you need to do. Okay, Jennifer Lopez is... Jessica Alba. I once tried to send a connection request to Jessica Alba. She asked for an email, so I couldn't connect with her. Um, yeah, let's let's see. Okay, she's showing the work. She's actually trying to show the work, and I like that. She had this kind of post polls <laughs> I don't know if the LinkedIn is the right place for this maybe yeah maybe not I'm not very familiar with it um, but definitely more text post so you can be more visible continue with that but add uh, a layer of the text post to it Mm -mm 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 -mm. let's see let's see let's see thank you guys for keeping up with me and staying live on the stream love or love gupta okay there's a okay photo open to work mm, is that getting anything to anyone open to work i don't know um I would like to hear from you because I don't think if that works. If somebody's open to work, I don't think I'm gonna contact them just because they're open to work. Because maybe maybe I'm wrong. Let me know. Uh, I'm a three-year computer engineer and undergrade. Um, my specialization data science. So I'm looking for an internship where I can refine my skills and learn new ones too. Um, okay, so. It's clear, just like add some grammar, some grammar mistakes, um, go over that and write your story. What should anybody give you an internship? Why are you more special than the others? Why, why you? That's it, like write your story, give an overview of something. Okay, here your feature section, you give your resume and like your PDF, maybe if you can share your journey. Look, guys, the journey is even if you apply for a job, if you apply somewhere for the internship and didn't get it, you have more experience than somebody behind you who didn't even apply. So you need to always have that in mind. You always have something to share. So share it, share your story. That's how you're going to get a job. Find companies that have, that you want to go to and uh, like, Explain them why they should hire you for an internship. Hello, connections. That's not going to fly. You cannot call people connections. In Serbia, they even call them dear connections. What the fuck? That's not how you call people. They are people, they are guys, they are, I don't know what, you can use so many expressions, but connections. Please don't do that. None of you. Data science. Okay, you have some experience. So, as I said, share it. Let's go further. Okay, 
Rashika Suresh. I hope I pronounced it well. Web developer, okay. I don't know what this photo represents. I'm not sure why it's there, but we need to see your face. We need to see who you are. Data science, business analyst, intern, as Black Foundation. Okay, and also like, okay, this is what you do, but how can what can you do for others? We design by passion, looking out for design front end data and opportunities. Resume, put the resume in the featured section. Explain, write it down in about section. So give people the chance to see something without having to click on it. And here you cannot even click. So guys, things are very simple. Just communicate them the right way. Okay, so I know that you're just developing it. You have received some recommendation. You have given some recommendation that, that is that is good. Let me see the, the posting. Better pictures, better quality. You have completed the internship. You have started select for scholarship. You have completed the task. But what was the experience of those things you have done? You never said anything. You just completed things and starting things. But what's, what are the outcomes? Those are the things that you can share that can make you separate you from the others and you can help them get to where they want to go. <laughs> okay. One more. Nadia. Nadia Luschak. No, no, refreshing one. People are quarantined, but creativity is not. We stay home and work diligently to help businesses transform and be closer to customers. Keep calm and social distance. Cool. This is refreshing. Refreshing after looking at those last two ones. Nadia began. Nadia, maybe you should talk about yourself in the like not as as a third party person. Nadia is widely known. Like I'm known for my process management, human capital, business leadership. It's your profile. It's not somebody else who's writing about you. And give more insights. Give the backstory. Give everything. Let people get to know you. Okay, you have feature section, the kind of things. See, you are, you are an active, got like full profile. That's okay. Yeah, one thing that you should all take care of it. So these numbers, these random numbers, you should get, get rid of those. How do you do that? Let me, let me tell you. So you go to your profile, edit public profile and URL, click here and here you can change it. So go ahead and use it. Also, let's check what you're posting. Also sharing from the pages, a lot of CEOs are doing that. I don't recommend it. And it's also external link, so double no. Launching an internship, that's all cool, but you're just sharing links and links are the least effective things on, on LinkedIn. Sometimes there is something else um, and you don't share much. Start sharing. I mean, you have almost 6,000 6, people following you. Why don't you show them, teach them something, help them do something with their lives? I don't know, those kind of things. It might be good, good thing to do. It seems like you have a lot of things to, to share. Now let's, let's go to see Adriana Dugunic, business developer and GTR, Glow Tax Reclaim. Cool. Mm, I am always, so Ed, how you can help others. 
Uh, there's no about us section. Add that section. You can see what I told the previous guys and ladies. Um, also, feature doc section is missing. This thing is okay. Maybe you can give recommendation to some people so they can give it to you or ask somebody to give it to you. Also endorsements, maybe this is a new profile. I don't know. Maybe you just need to go and start doing things. Let's see if you've been posting, comping, so basically sharing company stuff. Yeah. Don't just share other people's stuff. If you are sharing other people's stuff, explain why you're sharing. Like just hashtags doesn't mean anything. Why are you sharing specific things? And I don't recommend sharing anything because you can see how many people are actually seeing it. So not many of them. And yeah, it's the new profile and I get that you will see how things are going and change a little bit. Go ahead and open up yourself to the people. Who is Adriana? What do you do? Why do you do that? What are your passions? How you, are you helping people solve their problems? Mix all of that. Choo, choo, choo. We are going into the finish, towards the finish line. Shiva Kumar. I know Shiva. We talked. We talked on a, on a podcast or a masterclass, whatever we can call it. Shiva in e-commerce at work. That's good. Talking a little bit about the company, head of strategy at Chorus. Shiva in e-commerce at work. Podcast host. Maybe also what Chorus does or what you do for Chloras. Um, hey, I'm Shiva, personal designer, marketing, and I use marketing for a current lead strategy. I love to be something in learning marketing, great fan of Gary V, David Cancel, Chris Walker, David Shepard, give, 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 ask. Man, share a little bit about what you know and how can you help people. I know that you know some things. And I know that you are knowledgeful, so go ahead and share it with people. First, first explain what, what, uh, how can you help them with, and then go ahead and uh, get into into details. I like the feature section. Love it. Activities. Okay, cool. The strategy. The, uh, Super nice. Give other people recommendations. Ask for recommendations. Uh, let's see. People are writing to Shopify the whole day. That's what I'd call like an active person. And sharing the podcast, sharing things from the podcast. Like it. I like it, man. I just need you to need to share a few things or a few from your perspective. So what's your point of view? What do you do? Those kind of things. You are doing good with sharing what others are saying. So go ahead and share a little bit about from your perspective. So let's go, let's go and see what Zlatan has to say. Everything white. I don't know if that's a good thing or no, Zlatan probably, you probably wanted to do it, to have it like this. Um, I think it's a wasted opportunity, to be honest, designer. Okay, I'm a multi designer, disciplinary focus on visual. Why are you focused on those things? Like, how did you become a designer? Uh, how can you help people? With what? Um, okay, you have some things here that you have done, which is great. Bravo for that. Product designers, editorial, product designers, designer, 
Okay, why did you become designer? How did you become designer? You didn't just start being one. Open up. Play this. See, why did you are sharing things? I don't see any of it. Actually, we're not connected. Okay, that's why I'm not seeing it. But, um, but I like you're sharing different different things. I mean, you're a designer. You need to share visual side of the of the things. So I would like to see why did you come up with specific design? Why did you decide to present it like that? You know those kind of things. Maybe try to to mix, to mix, uh, to mix that. And we have like Facebook page. Is Serbia? Let's see. Let's see. Meet the teams. This is Watch 500 company global leader. Is I, I don't like this is the default thing. Maybe like this, it's better to leave it. And also, it's not a fit. I know it's it's a pain in the ass with Facebook changing their dimensions all the time, and it's probably that is the reason why it looks like this. Mid teams. Fish for fucking company, global leader financial services technology, lead by tub 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 cool 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 cool. You fill in all of those things. But uh as I already seeing the engagement on Facebook, it's not it's, you know, I like how you're doing. It's a bit different than what I've been seeing recently. And I like some of those things. Yeah, it's definitely, definitely different. I don't have anything to say. At least just maybe don't waste time on Facebook pages. That's, that's all that I have to say about Facebook these days. Uh, and Instagram, well, looking at the Facebook for this company and now looking at Instagram, I guess they are doing good over there. I don't know how old is the account, but it's more Instagramish kind of kind of content with these colors and everything. Let me, can I see actually how many people are reacting to it? Yeah. Okay, it's getting kind of attraction. I don't know what is your focus you had, but I hope it's on Facebook and Instagram that where people you are going after her uh, because like, I don't know. I don't see it working for hiring and for those kind of internships and other and other stuff. And that's it. That's it, guys. Not not two hours, but like fifteen minutes less than two hours. So nice. I hope I help someone. Uh, and I didn't offend anyone. That wasn't the, the purpose. Um, let me know if I can help you further with with, with something. Uh, I like to actually help people. That's that's the point of, of this to maybe give you an overview that you didn't have. I'll show you something that that uh, that you didn't see or didn't think about. So you can maybe go and improve certain things. And yeah, that's. That's it. Uh, it's Friday. Have a great weekend. Buy something if you didn't for the Black Friday. Find something you like and uh, talk to you a different time. I'll post this video also on YouTube. So don't worry, you will get the recordings. And 
thank you for for being here and keeping me company for for all this time bye bye guys keep it funky <laughs>